So today I was looking at uh, one of the question on the community about uh, attachments on uh, script uh, on on Jira server. In fact, Jira service desk, and uh, the question is all about uh, how to remove uh, attachments of a specific uh, type. Now, if you if you read this question from Mark, Mark is asking about. Uh, uh, so let me read the question. We have script script runner and we would like to use it to remove all the p dot p seven s attachments from our service desk tickets. I think I have an idea how to do it, but my problem is that I'm getting general errors trying to add the commands. Okay, so the question is all about uh, how to remove uh, attachments of a specific. Uh, Type so basically using a, using a specific extension. Uh, I mean, when you look at the file name, when you retrieve the file name of uh, a file or an attachment, you can also get the attachment, or rather, I should say, the file extension in the file name. And uh, to solve this problem, what you can do is uh, you can use. Uh, I do have. I, I don't really remember if I shared a script already. I don't really have a script that will do each and everything like do exactly this, but. Uh, I do have a script that can uh, use uh, attachment manager to to basically get all the attachments of an issue. So if you look at this particular uh, a line here, using this line component accessor dot uh, attachment manager dot get attachments, and then of course I'm using the issue object. You can actually get all the attachments of an issue, only one issue. And then uh, you can uh, use uh, methods like uh, file size or maybe file name, for example, to then further find the extension name. So what you need to do, I have already re replied to his question. First, try to fetch all the issues on which you want to um, do this analysis. So maybe if you're talking about uh, a service desk project, then uh, you can. Uh, Write a script to pass issues returned by a JQL, and I have talked about it on on my channel. I think if you if you go to my my list of all the videos on a script runner on server, I'm sure you can find this uh, example and a script, of course. So if you go to mastering script runner for Jira, and if you maybe type in here, let me just do a quick search. JQL. Okay, so pass JQL to perform search and bulk operations. So basically, what you can do, you can uh, first retrieve the issues based on a JQL, and when you get uh, the when you get the response, or basically when you're parsing the issues one by one, then of course uh, for each and every issue, uh, do this. Like, uh, I mean, this th this particular part should be in a in a loop. So you can do this for each and every issue that are that, that is returned by the JQL, and for those issues, maybe you can uh, use uh, these methods like get file uh, name. And when you're doing this, uh, you can also take a look at one method. I believe there is there is a method to remove uh, the attachment. So if you're talking about uh, one of the attachment, let me just type in here. Uh, um, I think you can do remove. I believe if I'm not wrong, or maybe. Attachment start remove. Uh, th there is definitely something that will, yeah. So I think I found something like remove, I guess. So this might be useful in case you want to, um, in in case you want to remove the attachment from the issue. And I also recommend you to to take a look at uh, the API. So I believe if you go to, if you just search Jira. Java API remove attachment. You will find one page definitely using attachment manager. So let us look at this particular page here. This is this is what I will do. So it says on this particular page somewhere, I guess. Let me just do a search. Remove. Oh yeah. So we have something called as remove or what? Delete. Delete attachment. So let us let us go back to the script. And uh, if I go to attachments, and of course this is not. One, but multiple attachments. So there might be there might be a method to to remove the attachment. Let me just try to uh, let me just try to f 
find that method if I can. Let me just go back and take a look. So it says uh, delete attachment and you have to pass the actual asset, uh, attachment. So maybe it is not really a method in the, uh, uh, the way I was doing it for a specific attachment. So I guess I need to check out, take a look at the, uh, so we are talking about uh, attachment manager. Okay, this is fine. And for those attachments, we need to then uh, uh, use this method. So we are talking about uh, delete attachment. Okay, so delete the attachment from the database. Okay, so this is the method that you need to use, and, and it will uh, it will take one one parameter that is uh, delete. Uh, that is basically the attachment. So let us say if I go to the component accessor. Come on, what happened? It, um, my IntelliJ is uh, complaining. It is a bit slow. Okay, now we have. IntelliJ back so component accessor dot attachment manager dot delete attachment so this is the method and you need to of course pass in the actual uh, attachment here if you maybe maybe if you take a look at this method here so it says uh, you have to pass the actual attachment which you, of course you are getting here like this variable in this in this case in my script attachments it will uh, show you and uh, give you a list of all the attachments for a specific issue and when you have those attachments then of course uh, if you find uh, so number one you have to pass the jql number two you have to then uh, write code uh, maybe few lines from this code to get the file name for uh, for that attachment and then uh, you need to use the delete attachment method uh, to delete the actual attachment using the script. I don't really remember if I did something recently, maybe long time back, I, 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 I don't really have a script that I can share uh, quickly. But uh, I have this in my list now, I will, I will probably write a script. I do have, I do have a script already with me, that will uh, retrieve the list of attachments, but not really do anything with those attachments. So uh, I guess I have uh, something to write. Now I will do that when I get time. And of course, I don't really want to just share one line of code. But I, I guess uh, if, if you just do component accessor dot attachment manager dot get attachments, then of course, pass the issue object. Or if you use the dot delete attachment, so it is all about adding a you know, few more lines, I don't think it will be a complicated script. But if you want to delete an attachment based on on this criteria where if you have attachments of a specific extension, you can definitely, and I believe we should be able to easily do it. And, uh, and uh, that is all I wanted to share in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.